Hello! This is y'all, Weasel. Uh, this is World of Warcraft for NES, and we have entered another world. Another world where everything is chocobo theme. <laughs> oh, hello! You're a friend. Nothing up there. Hey! Time for some more translation. I've been waiting for you for a long time. Says Kelsas! Kelsas! Kelsassy! Oh, <laughs> and I, I'm fine with that, I'll just walk up to you. It seems to be a high spirit, but is it different? What do you have for me? <laughs> I like that uh, the way Illidan starts a conversation is, what do you have for me? What, what are you, what can you do for me? <laughs> what, what is your gift to Illidan today? Oh, it's Fashy, I remember you. Kael'thas, Kael'thas Sunstrider is also a descendant of our Highborn. I let him wait for you here. I allowed him to wait for you here. I didn't tell him to, but I did allow it. I've heard that most of the High Spirits were banished to the bottom of the sea to become Naga. We thought we were killing them. They just became Naga somehow. And there were a group of descendants of Thorian who guarded the Well of Eternity. I heard all of this. Oh, that's right, because he was in prison for 10,000 years. <laughs> well, after the druid represented by your brother Malfurion was in power, the act... Uh, okay, after the Druids, represented by your brother Malfurion, was in power, the activities of the Highborn were closely monitored and controlled. But it was fortunate that you created a second Well of Eternity in Mount Hijal. I remember doing that! Let us regain magic power, so we renamed it as Sindore or Blood Elf. One of these two names. Is Sindore Blood Elf in, in our language or something? Blood Elves? No wonder it looks different than the Night Elf. Okay, so we're Night Elves, and I guess something about using the different Well of Eternity turned them into Blood Elves, and the Blood Elves are beige, while the Night Elves are cyan. <laughs> no, well, yeah, they're kind of beige. They're jaundiced, basically. They're jaundiced elves. Malfurion, to consolidate the druid's regime, will our high spirits order the expulsion will never permit return. So, okay, I, I understood this one. To consolidate the druid's powers, he expelled the high-spirited blood elves. In this way, we left our hometown father, Dasraima, to establish the kingdom of Kelthalas on the mainland of Lodelan. At first, our Blood Elves and humans formed alliances. Although we have helped the humanity gain battlefield victory many times, we have did not get human trust. On the contrary, we have come to make it difficult for us to do- we have- what, I, what did I read that from? On the contrary, we have to make it difficult for us to do so. I finally decided to go their separate ways with stupid people and their alliances. I came here to seek ways for the ethnic groups to survive the crisis. So the Blood Elves and the humans were friendly, and then they kind of split, and now, uh, he's here to try and make it work again. It is to get rid of the pain of losing the source of magic. You find the right person, I can help you. But worth the help you see your performance? Now I'm going to take the Temple of Darkness, this is an opportunity for you to perform. Okay, so basically, uh, I, I do need help, and, uh, if you feel like you're not enough of a performing seal, or, or, then you can perform for me, I guess? Oh, he joined, okay. <laughs> not even any conversation, just sort of, hey, you could join me, then he walks into my face, and now he's joined me. Whatever you say, Vidya Game. Oh, and battle, so we get to see what kind of performance, uh, what, what kind of performance he offers. Uh, oh dear. I really need to get some magic back, as it turns out. Everybody. Uh, including our new friend. Everyone needs magic. For all I know, he does good, uh, physical damage, but I'm not even trying. Okay. Whatever enemy this is, Edward Scissor's ha Scissor Hands doesn't seem to be doing much, uh, damage, so not that concerned. Why don't you do some damage to our vile enemy? Okay, he's doing a little bit of damage, no big deal though. 
Take that! Oh, he's dead. I <laughs> didn't have an opportunity to try our new friend, but whatever. <laughs> Bye. Welcome to Tarokar Forest. Tarokar! The, the place of tarot cards, I guess. See what vile new enemies we find in Tarokar! None! No enemies at all! <laughs> I'm fine with that! That tree is alive! <laughs> Uh, maybe not. <laughs> we find a generic orc in orange! <laughs> Let us, uh, murder time. I would love to try our new friend, but, uh, he's apparently never gonna get the opportunity. <laughs> oh, maybe you will. Only leaving these battles in in hopes of our new friend actually doing something. Okay. First off, let's quickly see if I can translate any of these. Hint, it won't work. Okay, the one on the right is Arcane Missile. The one below is Frostbolt. Don't know what the one I'm currently pointing at is. But let's see what Frostbolt does. It appears to be an attack all spell. Not that I've ever fought more than one enemy, but it didn't make me select him. Bye! Okay, so just reasonable attack skills. Oh, what did we pick up? Ghost Mushroom. 747 experience! Is this a path? No. <laughs> Thanks for making it look like it might be a path, though! Welcome to Shadow Moon Valley! Looks really similar to Terrorcar Forest! So are we in the human world or what? Because I thought we were finding humans here. Uh, you always will cast death. Victory! This isn't even, like, there's not multiple paths. This is just a long walk. What? What? Welcome to the Dark Temple. Am I crazy or does this look like a kind of familiar scene? Kind of looking like the beginning of the Vigia game. Maybe not. Maybe. Clicky clicky? Nope, doesn't do anything. Except initiate battle, you always will cast death! Victory! 46 money units, 747 uh, uh, experience units. Oh yep, I was right! This sure is familiar, this looks very familiar to me! It's the Temple Hall, it's the beginning of this video game! <laughs> Somebody's having a seizure over there! <laughs> Maetheridton! Who dared to break into the castle of the king? A comma? Don't I know a comma? <laughs> there are other people who are still mortals and come in. King, give them some color. Sunburn them. I came to receive your city. I'm taking it in tax. This was a comma's line, which it mistranslated, but I'm just gonna leave it like that. A comma is really shy, and you will soon regret it. <laughs> I do not know the devil. Let me turn into gray. Um, okay. We're gonna let him turn into gray. Wish I'd saved a bit more recently. This is a uh, thing. <laughs> okay, let's, uh, I'm gonna use her exclusively as a healer, and I'm just gonna go for my highest level spells always. So, when we have at least two bars, highest level spell goes. Ouchies. Eh, not really ouchies. Not a big deal, we're fine. Okie dokie, but you... Use your highest level spell! Okay, he's not hurting me too bad, I think I'm fine. How are we doing against him? 73, not that impressed actually, how about you? Okay, he's, he's barely hurting us, so at least that much is uh, under control. 146. I think our new character just isn't very good. <laughs> it's not surprising, but it is uh, unfortunate. Uh, okay. You're getting uh, awfully high. You're gonna have to use your magic on something. Oh, for example, healing our friend that I've forgotten to heal. That would be a good thing to do. <laughs> Duh. How about, is this healing? Yes, that's healing. Heal our, our very, very dead friend. 
Yeah, attack the one who uh, is is not going to uh, reciprocate. There we go, healing. Take that. Ah, okay, Tracy Schultz in chat is making jokes because a comma, whereas we should be fighting a period or something. Grammar jokes! <laughs> the best jokes are grammar jokes or punctuation jokes or whatever. Ow, that hurt! <laughs> that hurt a lot! I mean, I can heal it back, but ow! That certainly was painful! Uh... Heal thyself, please. I'm not doing damage very often, but when I do do damage, it's plenty. And I can heal quite well, so I think we're doing fine. Take that! Uh, take nothing! <laughs> Kazam! I don't like when I accidentally waste a little bit of MP, but oh well, it happens. Alright, we're all in pretty good shape. Let's just continue building up our magic. We want to do absurd amounts of damage. Crazy damage! Okay, nobody desperately needs healing, so let's just do an attack move. Let's do this one. And then somebody needs healing, but not desperately. How will this do? That's uh, all right for being such a low level spell. Why don't you also heal yourself? I feel like if you didn't uh, know, well actually we both need healing. <laughs> if you didn't know how to sort of read uh, all the stats and such and understand how to you know, heal and do that kind of thing, this could be quite difficult. <laughs> could be excessively difficult. Good thing for translation. And as it turns and as it as it stands here, like so long as I have a healer on my team, I'm certainly far from invincible, but uh it would be unlikely for me to die stupidly here. Unless, of course, he does like randomly huge uh damage spikes, which could always happen. Because I'm doing 144 every few turns. And that seems pretty good. Okay, once again, do nothing this turn. The best turns do nothing. Do something. Use some of your magic. Uh, why don't we actually heal main character man? <laughs> Illidan, I think is his name. I don't remember. Look at that! You can't damage me fast enough! I can't damage you fast enough either, but still. <laughs> I just, I wish I had a faster way to regain magic, because that's like all I'm doing now. Oh, this is, this is going to be a dramatic turn. <laughs> take that. Take that. Take that. Kablam. Kablam, miss. <laughs> so much for a dramatic turn. Oh, how dare you survive my onslaught. How dare you. Thirty died. And back into just regain magic mode. Hooray! Was this uh, boss music always this boring? <laughs> they seem to have gone for a two bar loop here. <laughs> or I guess four bar loop or something. It's a very short loop. Do, 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 do. Oh my god, I don't remember the boss music being this unspeakably bad. I mean, I don't remember it being great, but jeez. 
Let's heal our stupid friend here. So that he can do his useless magic. Ha, oh, you missed me. You ought to try harder than that. I'm putting on a sort of bad New York accent for no reason. A really more sort of transatlantic. Aha! Take that! I've run out of anything to say because this is an extremely repetitive battle. <laughs> I kind of feel like with this game, it could just end. <laughs> like, who knows when it's going to end. I might beat this boss and then the game is over. I'm afraid of that, actually. Yeah, that hurts. <laughs> you really got me now. Okay, that one kind of hurt. This is a very slow battle. <laughs> I don't know what to do about that. It's just excruciatingly slow. <laughs> I don't want to do Y'all Weasel Cast Death for a boss battle. Oh my god, how much HP does this jerk have? <laughs> oh, it goes on forever. Eh. Miss, you jerk. I got nothing left to say. This, this is the excitement that is World of Warcraft for NES. <laughs> you just press the same button over and over again. How exciting is the actual World of Warcraft? More? Less? <laughs> Never played it. No experience. I mean, once you've got yourself into a stable state like this, then it's just like waiting to do enough damage. I should see how uh, how the, the new guy's actual just normal attack does. I never use the attack for uh, Illidan because he's certainly a magic guy. So let's see how the normal attack does on our new, new uh, pal. Ten! <laughs> Not worth it! Thank you! Okay, nobody desperately needs healing. Take this! Take all of the things I am offering to you! Take that! Oh my, he's not dead yet! <laughs> how, how much HP does this idiot have? <laughs> wow. This is gonna be the long haul, I think. <laughs> Who boy, we are in for it. Ow, 94? Uh, don't ki Okay, she is dead! That is a real problem. Uh, oh dear. I don't think I have anything to do about that. I don't think I have any solution to the she is dead problem. It is entirely possible that one of these revives, but even with the translation, it's impossible to know what any of them do. I mean, it will let me use it on her, but I think it'll let me use any of them on her. Let's try just wasting something that definitely won't work. Oh, that wor- what?! <laughs> okay, all you need is just any restorative item. Turns out this game is really easy. Okay, didn't even know that. Just need any restorative item at all. Great. So I carry around restorative items not to uh, not to heal people mid-battle, but to bring them back to life. <laughs> Outstanding. I am completely satisfied with that, actually. Take that! Please die already, <laughs> Infiboss! <laughs> Go away! Oh my god, how much HP does he have?! <laughs> It's not even like, it's it's not difficult at this point, it just goes on forever! How much HP does this idiot have? Okay, I'm gonna do another 150 damage or whatever, I'll bet that won't leave a scratch against this infiboss. 
I feel like the amount of HP the boss has and the amount of HP the boss does are not particularly aligned, as in does in damage, that is. There doesn't seem to be any real logic to it. I don't know what else to say here. I just, I don't want to, you always will cast death against a boss, but what an unbelievably boring boss. <laughs> okay, you always will cast death. It's about freaking time. There's only one more turn after you always will cast death. <laughs> Victory! 226 money units, 3,625 experience. Level up for Illidan. Level up for, what the heck is her name? <laughs> Fascist! Fashy! Oh, and the, the, the jerk face didn't get a level up, okay. Uh, let's, let's continue this sure-to-be-endless cutscene conversation next time! <laughs> Shall we? Shall we next time? Until then, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, tell me what you like best on this or any other video on my channel to help me make compilations. Cheers! From Y'all Weasel.